after we were all born we met a lot of new people who filled our lives with experiences and moments now it might not always be great moments sometimes they might have messed it up or sometimes we might have messed it up but they all certainly fill a void in our lives as the time goes by and just like that on this day i have hit another age so today we'll make something that was traditionally used to measure the passage of time that is an hour glass select the front plane and the front view and click on sketch and now set the three point arc place it somewhere here now we are making the neck of the arc glass okay continue with another arc and okay that's done now i want these two to be in tangent so select the tangent constraint and that's it now they are both in tangent now dimension it i want it something a little over 6 inch all right now just complete the bulb part of the r glass that is the top portion now mirror this sketch select the top plane and select the sketch all right now we got it that is the neck portion now let's revolve the entire sketch select the revolve axis as this axis all right then click on the green tick now we want to fill sand so we need a hollow right here and right here select the shell tool I'm going for a 0.1 inch as you can see here it's shelled all the way click on the green tick all right now go to top view and select the yeah this plane right here we will be sketching the top portion over it select a circle or the center point origin and create a circle now i'm going for a slight design work here so i'm going to again select a circle and make one right here it's just a different pattern that's it I'm going to cut these unnecessary parts now i want it uh, three of such sketch so i'm going for circular pattern click on the pattern and there you go now we have three such pieces now let's cut the unnecessary lines and curves all right now we have the top portion ready and extr extrude it and now i don't want it to be 1 inch let's go for a 0.5 okay that seems fine now make it new all right click on the green tick all right the top portion is ready uh, if you want to make it transparent you can do that because we really want to see the sand right or whatever the material that's inside you can do it like this you can adjust the transparency by this tool now we want to mirror it on the bottom as well so select part 2 go for mirror now it's asking for mirror plane so select that and select the mirror plane as top plane see there is another one now it's it has to be new as well all right all right now these are done but uh, these are not yet structurally stable so we need some small plastic columns right let's initially let's first change the color of it now blue looks good i think i am going for a yellow it looks nice now select this face and sketch it we are going to make the columns 
so okay i got a origin point right here of the earlier circle uh, i'm going to make this as one inch all right now let's extrude it now you can manually adjust it also that's why pulling this arrow or you can enter the value as well if you are not sure at what height it is uh, there is a tool right here instead of going for blind see go for up to the face up to face and select which face you want that sketch to extrude up to okay so that's done uh, you can make it new as well we'll combine all the elements later on now this is another part this column now i want it on all other two places also so there is an option called circular pattern this is a part so we are going for part pattern and select the axis just select this one now there are four just make it three all right just confirm that now it's ready right uh, now i want to combine these parts i just want that glass that is the bulb element to be one material and the other can be different material so these are all combined now I'll just uh, change the color again to yellow yellow look nice all right our our glass is ready now let's go for a real time render right here just unhide all the views and go for shaded and okay now we will go for shaded without edges that's a more realistic one yeah this is how it would look after manufacturing now just like the hour glass even in life if something is missing you can always turn it around and fill it with fondness and happiness so that's it for this lesson but hold on there is a cake right here enjoy the digital cake since you can't smack the cake here's what you can smack so hit that like button share and subscribe thank you and see you in the next lesson cheers